Have you ever wondered if reality really exists when nobody's looking? That classic question, if a tree falls in a forest and no one's around, does it make a sound? Isn't just philosophy, it's at the heart of quantum physics. Back in 1927, Einstein and Niels Bohr had a fierce debate about this. Einstein said, God does not play dice, he believed reality is always there whether we see it or not. But Bohr pushed back, arguing that things only become real after you measure them. This all comes down to something called the complementarity principle. Basically, quantum objects, like electrons, have pairs of properties, like position and momentum, that can't both be measured at the same time. If you check one, you mess up the other. Now let's talk about the double slit experiment. If you shine light through two slits and don't watch, it acts like a wave, creating a wild interference pattern on the wall. But if you peek to see which slit the light went through, suddenly it acts like a particle and the pattern disappears. Physicist John Wheeler took this further in 1978. He waited until after the light had already passed the slits to decide how to measure it. Incredibly, his choice still shaped how the light behaved, like reality waited for him to make up his mind. Fast forward to 2022. Scientists in Brazil used nuclear magnetic resonance to mess with atoms and confirmed Bohr's principle in a whole new way. Their experiment shows that in the quantum world, mutually exclusive properties, like wave and particle, don't contradict. They actually complete each other. So, is reality shaped by our observation? In the quantum realm, the answer may just be yes. And as we build quantum computers and futuristic tech, this weirdness isn't just fascinating, it's the foundation of our future.